of the key things that I've heard during meetings already this week, um, certainly related to uncertainty. Um, so companies have experienced a bounce back um, pre uh, post COVID. Um, they've really seen that in their order books. Uh, and I think that's going to carry a lot of companies through 2023. With the outlook for 2024 much more uncertain. Topics like inflation, uh, China COVID situation, uh, the Russian Ukraine um, war still continuing, as well as supply chain issues which are easing uh, in terms of materials and components. It's still a big issue for companies figuring out as they get into to 2023. And with that, I think one of the words that's cropped up a lot during meetings and you see around the place is resilience. Um, so how are companies going to deal with those challenges as they get into next year? And that will relate to supply chain localization, um, companies increasingly relying on integration of IT and OT technology to help give them that um, openness, that flexibility, and um, to help deal with some of those challenges. I think the final thing I would call out would be sustainability. We've heard a lot around circular economy, you know, in terms of hardware and, and how that can be extended. Um, but also topics uh, like high efficiency motors, um, drives. Um, and really sustainability being used as a way for companies to differentiate themselves which we know is going to be increasingly important going forward and to help contribute to goals um, globally to, to reduce climate change.